Let's talk about the best round brushes for blow drying your hair. If you're new to my channel and if you're not, welcome back. I'm Mike. I'm who? I'm a hairdresser, a L'Oreal colour specialist, a makeup fan and a skincare lover. In today's film we are talking about the best round brushes for blow drying your hair. So if you want to find out what round brushes I love for blow drying hair, then you better keep on watching. What is the story everyone? In today's film we are talking about round brushes for blow drying your hair. FYI you guys, I am a professional hairdresser. So my kit or my brushes will look slightly different to everyone else's. Why? Because the brushes I use in the salon have to give me the optimal result that I'm looking for. They have to be resistant, they have to have longevity, etc, etc. So the brushes I use are very much professional hairdressing brushes. Think of it this way, same if you have a makeup artist. A professional makeup artist kit, their brushes and all the equipment they have would look completely different from what you would have. So the brushes I have are really good quality brushes that I love, that I use, that last me forever and help me perform everything I need to do with hair. So you guys, starting off with the brush I cannot live without for blow drying hair in general and that brush is Ibita Brush B3. When it comes to this brush, this is probably the best brush on the market and if you're a client of mine and you're watching this, this brush probably has touched your hair at some point. Ibita brushes are probably the best and my favorite brushes when it comes to brushes in general and this is your classic wooden natural fiber and corkscrew brush. So let's talk about this a tiny bit more. When it comes to the cork First of all, cork is very comfortable in your hand and it's naturally sourced and sustainable. When it comes to wood, so we obviously we have the wood inside and what wood does in those brushes is wood will actually absorb the heat so it protects your scalp and it protects your hair. And natural fiber bore bristle brushes are just brilliant. Natural fibers, think of it this way, you're brushing hair with hair. So the hair is not going to get static, you're going to get very voluminous, shiny, beautiful looking hair. And this brush is a holy grail. Whether you're looking for volume, whether you're looking for root lift, whether you're looking for bend, whether you're looking for waves, this brush will do everything for you. I use this brush for nearly everything and on everyone. It is gentle, it is perfect for short hair, so you can do it for a bob, so if you want to give it a nice smooth lift to the bob, or for medium hair, if you want to give it a curl, if you want to give it a bend. Now, when it comes to natural bore bristle brushes, they will give you more of a softer, glamorous result compared to your classic ceramic brushes that are gonna give you more of a structure. But now, overall, if you're looking to invest in a good brush, this brush is everything. It smooths through the hair absolutely beautiful. It's lovely to blow dry hair back with it. It sits lovely into the hair. I absolutely adore this brush. Moving on to another brush, and that brush is Ibiza Hair EX4 Brush. So like that, we have another cork brush from Ibiza Hair. And like that, this one is slightly different, is a lot more denser, and it's bigger, and it's a darker bristle. This brush is absolutely perfect for unruly long hair. So if I have a client that has really frizzy hair, really coarse, really thick hair, this brush will smooth it out really, really well and the bristle on it is really, really tight. So it's gonna give you that optimal shine and seamless finish to the hair. This is perfect for smooth blow dries. You can give a bend to the hair. You can give some sort of a curl. You can give volume. This brush is absolutely perfect. And like that, if you have really, really frizzy hair and really coarse hair and unruly hair and it's hard for you to smooth it out, this brush will do it for you. The next brushes I will be talking about are Ibiza brush or be serious. So those are your classic ceramic brushes from Ibiza brush. Like that, we're talking about Ibiza brush again. And when it comes to my kid, most of my brushes are from Ibiza brush because they're good brushes, they last you a long time and you can do so much with them and they have variety of brushes depending on the hair. But when it comes to ceramic brushes, this is actually a mix of natural and synthetic fiber. So when it comes to those brushes, I find like ceramic brushes are very good for creating structure. So let's say the medium sized brush, I would use this a lot for wavy blow dry. So if I'm trying to create like a beachy wave or your classic curly blow dry, that's what I would use 
that brush for it. So yeah, I would use this brush a lot in my salon for anything like curly blow dries, wavy blow dry, any type of blow dry. If I need to create structure, ceramic brush is definitely a yes for me. So if you're doing that kind of blow dry that you like to leave your brushes in, ceramic brush is a yes. Then obviously we have two other sizes. We have the smaller one, so that will be for your tighter curls. Or if someone has really, really straight hair, you do this for a nice wavy blow dry. The next brush is actually a very, very interesting brush and I love using this brush and that brush is Regin Combs Ellipse Brush. So as we can see, that's another wooden cork and natural bristle brush. But as we can see, there is a very, very interesting dent in this brush. I would use this brush a lot for like say, glamorous, wavy, curly blow dress. And like that, this is in the larger size, so it's gonna give you more of a bend and softness, but also this brush is really good for creating just smoothness through the bob. But what's brilliant about this brush is, if we can see that bend is, so when you're blow drying hair, right, this brush will actually sit in really, really nicely because of that bevel over here. So if you're blow drying hair, boom, 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 and that will just sit really nicely into the hair. When I first seen it, I was a bit like, oh, that's a very interesting, strange brush. I don't know what I would use this for. But if you're creating a big, voluminous, beautiful, smooth blow dry with curls in it, this brush is brilliant because it just sits really in. And sometimes if I'm blow drying hair, I'd have like, let's say, three brushes in, especially if the hair is really frizzy or unruly or really thick and you want to create that nice, beautiful wave boom, 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 put them brushes in and leave them in. The last set of brushes I will be talking about are GHD ceramic brushes. Now, when it comes to GHD ceramic brushes, I use them quite a lot in the salon, like that. When it comes to this size brush, you'd use it for something like a curly blow dry. So, let's say I'd be doing a curly blow dry and the client likes to leave the brushes in. So, if you like your brushes in, I might use those two and just leave the brushes in as I'm going. Also for nice wavy blow dry, this brush is absolutely brilliant because you're getting that nice structure. When it comes to the bigger one, if someone wants more of a bigger defined curl, I find this brush really, really good. And those brushes also last really well. The only downfall of the GHD brushes is, and I'd like that to change. So GHD, if you're watching this, is this part over here. Because what can happen is your hair might actually get stuck in this. And that's what I do not like about ceramic brushes in general. They have that top, most of them, and the hair can get stuck in it. But overall, I think the GHD brushes are really good for affordable price. When it comes to picking brushes for your hair or for your kid, whether you're a hairdresser or you need new brushes like that, we obviously have the cork wooden brushes that are very good for the hair. They're gonna give you amazing shine. They're brilliant for coarse hair. They're brilliant for hair that doesn't like to behave and they give that beautiful shine and they're not static and they give you that beautiful finish to the hair. If you're looking for more structure in your blow dry and more of a defined curl or a bent, a ceramic brush is definitely for you. Whether you go for the Ibiza brush or GHD brush, it's up to you, but they're both very, very good brushes. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching today's film. I hope you found this film rather interesting, helpful, and useful. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Also, check out my other social media. And of course, you guys, please, please, please do take care. Bye.